TSN 9 News reporter Carla Draxler has some advice from a dermatologist on how to stay masky free. Dermatologists say that maskne, acne caused by a mask, is nothing unusual, but can be quite frustrating. So I started noticing that I, um, I had a lot of pimples under my chin, and I would never get that, and I didn't know what was happening. Irene wears her mask six hours a day while at work, and is not the only one with this problem. So we are seeing an increase in face mask-induced acne since the COVID pandemic. Dr. Simpson says this type of acne used to be more common among athletes athletes wearing tight chin straps that can cause irritation. But now with an increase in mask use, more people are suffering from breakouts. The heat and the humidity underneath the mask dilates the pores. And when your pore gets dilated, then increase oil, increase dirt, uh, bacteria, and increased kind of dead skin cells can get clogged into those pores and create the inflammatory acne papule. Dr. Simpson suggests washing your mask frequently or using disposable masks. But she adds you might also want to update your skincare routine. You can get a uh, over-the-counter uh, cleanser like this that has benzoyl peroxide in it, which is an ingredient that kills bacteria on contact. Another good over-the-counter face wash would be one that has salicylic acid. Salicylic acid helps to slough off the dead skin cells, and that way it opens up the pores a little bit. The chances of breaking out vary depending on the type of mask you're using. Masks considered more effective against coronavirus will likely cause more acne. But Dr. Simpson says you should prioritize your health and safety before anything else. Protect yourself from the COVID first and foremost, and then worry about the acne. Dermatologists say that not only will we have to wash our hands more often, but our faces as well. And don't forget to moisturize. In Central El Paso, this is Carla Draxler, KTSM 9 News.